what's up you Americans and today we are going to be doing a video we are going to be going to do pellet gun video not a BB gun video this is the Benjamin 392 and um yeah it hurts well I haven't been shot by it but it does some damage now the Benjamin 392 is a pellet gun it doesn't shoot BBs it's a very interesting pellet gun at, gun at that. Now, this is dry. It's not pumped at all. So, I just cocked it to show you guys how it works. It uses a bolt. Again, dry fired. It uses a bolt that you open and you put your pellets in there. And you close it up. You pump it as many times as you want. Not really. The maximum is eight. And then you can shoot it. Woo! What's up, cowboy? Okay, anyways. And what it shoots, because it doesn't shoot BBs, like I previously stated. It actually shoots pellets. And these aren't the normal pellets that you'd find in a pellet gun. Normal pellet guns actually shoot .177 pellets. So I have an interesting video coming soon with a pellet gun that does shoot .177. But these, this boy, shoots .22. So that's the same diameter of a 22 long rifle, which I think is awesome. And today, we will be shooting pointy boys, not hollow pointy boys. Because hollow pointy boys are expensive. So yeah. Now what I want to be shooting at today. So I'm first going to be shooting at the cardboard box all the way over there has some duct tape on it. I don't know if it's sighted incorrectly, so I'll have to check that. I shot it like two weeks ago, and I sighted it in, but I don't know if it's completely sighted in. And then after that, we'll have fun killing some Red Baron, because kill the Red Baron. Also, some American beverage. So yeah, that's how this video is going to work. Now that we have our Benjamin 392 pumped and ready, we just need to open the bolt, put one of our pointy boys in, not hollow pointies, normal pointy boys, that's what they look like. Stick it in the chamber, close the bolt, now put on these super goofy eye protections, and we'll shoot that cardboard box in three, two, Let's go review the damage. So it appears as if that we hit right there. This is where I was aiming, just straight in the middle. So I'm going to take another shot and aim better. I only took like literally two and a half seconds to aim. So yeah, I'll do that. Shot number two with pointy boy. I think we either grazed the can or hit it because I saw it and I heard it moving. I honestly thought we grazed it. I got it sighted in perfectly. It went straight through, went all the way through my boxes and into the black trash can. Next up, we're going to be shooting water in a tube. Tube. Now that we have our goofy goggles back on and the Benjamin 392 loaded, that water bottle over there will not stand a chance. I don't know if you can see it, but it is over there. I'm pretty sure I hit it. What I meant to say is I know it hit it because that's not normal. When you flip it upside down, I'm pretty sure I hit it, and I'm pretty sure I just got soaked by throwing that behind my head. But, yeah, we'll take, I sighted that in really well. We'll take, um, one more shot at Coke can or water bottle, and then, yeah. Now I'm going to do what I said I wasn't going to do at the beginning of the video which is shoot it with a hollow pointy boy which uh i'm gonna shoot it only because i want to see 
with the type of energy transfer I can see on that water bottle over there. And well, feeling it may be a bit exciting. I definitely hit that. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this on camera, but this is bottle number one. You can see what the type of hole it made on the entrance wound. That was with the pointy boys. And this is the hole we made with the hollow pointy boy. And you can see there's plastic. I don't know if you can see, but there's plastic right there that's been pushed and like displaced. There's just kind of like a spread that did a ton of damage and pushed it out of the way. So now I'll show side by side the one on my right uh, is the hollow point. The left is the normal. Hopefully now you guys can see it better. But see there, right there, it's all moved plastic. Like, that got blown out. Like a whole sheet of plastic. No, like, the energy transfer is actually insane. It took this whole sheet of plastic off of the water bottle. This whole sheet, when the hole is only like that big, it, it's, it's insane. Well, if you enjoyed this, and if you enjoyed seeing me shoot the Benjamin 392, well, then you better leave a subscribe down there. And also like the video, comment, say what your favorite part was, do whatever, share, of course. Um, and well, I'm your host, El Nino5373 James, and I will see you in the next one. Is easy clear to see that AK is no mystery?